Hey guys, what's going on? It's Vortex here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Smart Moving Mod for 1.6.2 and later releases. Uh, for the first couple of bits of software you're going to need is Notepad++ and WinRAR Archiver. You can use 7-Zip, but for this video I'm going to be using WinRAR, so if you don't have any of them, you're best off probably getting WinRAR. But you can use 7-Zip. Just a slight difference. So, first thing you need to do is download three little mods for the actual mod itself. First one, obviously, is the Smart Moving mod. You just scroll down here and um, click here for the download. So just click that, and then you click. Obviously, the I'm going to be doing this with Mod Loader because I just thought it'd be easier. Just click on Mod Loader, and then uh, that will bring you over to here. Then you want to um, scroll down and then click download add fly and then obviously when it comes up here with 54321 then skip press skip and then you want to come to player API which is this one and then you just want to press download on the render 1.1 so once you've got all those downloaded we can start modding so what you want to do is hit in percent app data percent and then hit enter so now you see your Minecraft folder. What you want to do is go into versions and then copy this whole file because this you do not mod this file. This is like your uh, legit unmodded sort of one. And then you just press paste. You want to rename this and let's call it SM for well easy easiness. Uh, so smart moving. And then you, what you have to do, whatever this file name is actually, whatever this file is actually called, you have to rename everything inside to it to be the same. So I have to rename all of these exactly the same, caps included. Rename them both SM. And then this is where Notepad++ comes in. Right click on here, edit with Notepad++, and where it says ID, then in quotations, use put. SM that has to be exactly the same as the file name. Then hit save and just close out of this. Right, so now we're actually getting to the modding stage. Want to click this, right click it, open with WinRAR Archiver. If you're using 7 zip, it will say 7 zip. So drag that to there, I move these over here, and I'll just minimize that for the time being. You just want to open up mod loader, let's do that first just put that there and then what you want to do is just select all of them drag and drop ok then we can close that, we've got mod loader in player API we can just drag that <coughs> actually there's a lot of stuff that doesn't just select those ones that actually need to be okay and then for smart moving itself see this one here since we've got mod loader you can do is then just copy that to the your desktop or something double click open this now you got smart moving you just want to drag and drop and paste it in and then, as always, guys, remember this is an absolute must delete meta int, otherwise, your mod will not work. And then you'll have, you'll have your game crash, and then people will be saying, My game is crashing, and then it turns out they forgot to delete meta int. So, always remember to do that, otherwise, you'll have problems. So, I'm just going to quickly launch up Minecraft. And what you have to do is come over to here, new profile, and we're going to call it. SM for smart moving and then where it says use version we're going to scroll down as to we see release SM so no no one do is save profile and then remember to select your profile before you go into game and then just press play so minecraft will load up and then uh, I'm just going to quickly go into uh, what's this mod? Right guys, after showing you how to install 
the smart moving mod I just thought I'd quickly give you a quick demonstration on what it's actually like to play with so um, yeah this is straight after I've installed it and yeah so a couple of cool features is uh, let's press F1 you hold shift then hold spacebar you can jump two high blocks and then if you hold shift and control you can sneak along the floor like this sneaky and then so yeah just get up I'll go into this wall so as you can see this is a, a four high wall and usually you couldn't jump up this sucker so what you want to do is hold shift and spacebar and then let go of shift and you just jump so yep so to get up this wall we're going to do a little quick combo we're going to do shift hold spacebar to jump and then when we're in there press control which grabs on as you can see so now I've climbed up to the top and you can see this wall goes straight into water so I'm just going to run jump into the water and yeah so as you can see we've got a totally different swimming so we're just doing a bit of breaststroke there and then when we get out of the water we do a bit out of like being under the water we do a bit of front crawl as you can see which is pretty cool so it doesn't really change on your f if you're in first person but when you're in third person it looks pretty goddamn cool so I hope this mod helped you and um, if you need any help just please ask um, I'll be happy to help you and I'm sure other people will help you if they're feeling kind and um, yeah if this video helped you just like and subscribe and uh, we have lots of good more videos coming out so um, yeah why not see you later